Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah if you are new here and today we are continuing the 100 baby challenge. I am pretty excited to film this today. I'm excited to film every video. <laughs> I say it in like every video. Just know that I'm always excited to be here filming for you. So in the last episode we moved out, we aged up and moved out a lot of people. I think it was like five five people we jack we did jackson and we did the four girls and a lot of you guys told me that i should have kept aurora in the household because now we don't have a female to take over if lily accidentally dies so we need to start having kids asap we need to have girls asap i'm really nervous but i think we have time she has six days until she ages up so we need to get her pregnant so she stops aging <laughs> Let's see what we can do. Let's get into this episode. Okay guys, here we are back in the house. Lily is currently not pregnant, so we need to get her pregnant. So which guy? Which guy? Who do we have romance with that we haven't had a kid with yet? We just had a kid with Benjamin. We've had a kid with Kengo. We've had one with Daichi. We've had one with Talon. We've had one with Dwayne. Reed. I don't think we've done Cliff yet. Lauren. We haven't done Anthony yet either. We haven't done Mac. He's married. Oh. Hmm. Let's just do Caleb. So we have Theodore, Harry, and the new baby Clive. I kept in Slice of Life just because... I don't know. I just wanted to. I just wanted to. Uh, I know it's crazy sometimes, but I kind of like it. It adds a bit of interest to the to the let's play. So yeah, School for Theodore and Harry starts in an hour. How, did you guys do your homework yet? No, you guys, you need to be doing your homework and you also have school projects, which we're definitely gonna get you to do. Lily, 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 Lily. Okay, Caleb should be awake now. Can we invite him over? Invite to hang out at current lock. Yeah, you need to have a shower. Oh, oh, he's here already. Oh, and he's taking care of the baby. Oh my gosh. Cheer up, parent. What the? Bye, guys. Have a great day at school. Why are you not going to school? Go, 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 go. Study hard. Okay, stop. Take care of the baby first. Can we romance him yet? Offer him a rose. He seems like the type of guy that would like a rose. What are they doing? <gasps> oh my god! What the? I did not tell them to do that. They have absolutely no romance in their bar. What? What? I did not tell them to do that. You guys saw? I did not do that. How did the... <laughs> You guys, what the heck? <laughs> this game never ceases to amaze me. Ever. Never, ever, ever. Oh my god, are you pre You're pregnant. <laughs> I am going to, like, not edit that chunk so that you guys can see that I did not tell her to do that. Girl. What's up? Come inside. It's raining. Come inside. It's raining. Chance of twins. And they're gonna be vampires. What's up, girl? Maybe we should, um... Hang on. She has been bald for too long. I think I like the idea that she shaved her head. So... Oh, hi, guys. Aww, they're all adults now. No, they're still young adults. Why do you guys have such crap outfits? Oh, nice one. Okay, let's just give her like a pixie cut. Oh, where'd all your skin details go? Sad day. Okay, let's give her a pixie cut. I'm excited to do this. I like never give my sims short hair, especially when they're females. Oh, so cute. How about this one? Ooh. 
adorable. So cute. Alrighty. So here she is with her new and improved look. Her hair is growing out. Where are you going? Don't leave me. Don't leave. Where are you going? There you go. Okay, not gonna lie, she kind of looks like she wants to talk to the manager. Come sell this painting. Come sell this painting and paint more stuff. So Harry is invisible, and then Theodore got bullied. Why do all my sims get the bullied one? It's really sad. Lily, what the heck? Please continue this painting. Oh my gosh, you're exhausted. Perhaps you should go to sleep. <laughs> Perhaps. And we need to start working on a relationship with someone else. Hello guys, you're back. Did you get better grades? B, B. Okay, so I just sent you some money. Thought you could use it. Thank you, Kango. <laughs> cool. Um, let's get them to do their schooly projecties. Come on, start working carefully. You too, my boy. So, what do you need to be doing? Get one skill to level three. Get one skill to level three. Okay. Well, it looks like they're going to be video gaming a lot. I feel like video games is the easiest way to get their skills up. Later, Violet. Oh, no. It's raining so hard. Okay, stop. Stop, stop, stop. Go and play a game, and I'll move your project inside for you. Okay, so it looks like Harry got to level three pretty quickly. I'm gonna get you to do your homework as well, and then you, you're just so tired. You just sleep it off, okay? And then we'll work on your stuff tomorrow. Okay, so it looks like Harry got his skills up, so he's gonna be good, but Theodore did not. Oh, that sucks. So one of them is going to be able to age up and the other one is not going to be able to. So we're going to have to wait another day. So frustrating sometimes. Is Harry a quick learner? Yeah, he gains skills faster from being an overachiever and he gains skills faster from being a happy toddler. All right, and he needs to get his responsibility up too before we can even age him up. So it doesn't even really matter. You're almost there though. You have a leg up on the competition with your responsibility. So once you guys get home, do your homework, do your school projects, and you should be good. Okay, I'm going to get you to get your relationship up with... We need to meet another man. That's what needs to be going down right now. All right, the next man that walks by our house, you're getting it. Oh, of course it's you. We already kind of know you, and I'm not interested. Who are you? Are you a girl? Nope, you're a man. Flirty introduction. Boom. Let's see if this works. There's another one, too. Where are you headed? Yes. Oh, you're very interesting looking. Like interesting. So. Offer rose. Sabal. Sabal. Oh. <laughs> he really likes us, like, right off the bat. We can do first kiss already. Well, that went from good to bad really fast. He was into it, and then he wasn't into it. Alright. Who's next? Who are you? Have we had kids with him yet? We haven't. Let's try. With her little chili, cute. Oh, and he's flirting with us now. Sweet talk him. Just checking on you. Aw, thanks Viola, you're so sweet. There we go. All better now. Okay, let's try flirting with him. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Yay! 
Harry's an A student. Theodore is not, which completely makes sense because he didn't get his skills up. So, Harry, you need to be doing your homework. You too, love. Please do your homework, both of you. I know you're, like, super sad from being bullied at school, but... Okay, they both finished their projects. They both finished their homework. Um, what else should you do to do responsibility? Set the table. You do extra credit. Yay, Lily painted a masterpiece, and it's a painting that I've never seen before in The Sims. That's pretty cool. I wonder how much it's worth. 1,787. That's pretty good. Oh my god. Look at this phone call we got. I'm calling to let you know that Makoa Kilahoa has passed away. No! <laughs> that was supposed to be our next baby daddy. Oh, what the heck? Dang it. <laughs> that is so frustrating. All right, how else can we get this responsibility up? Doing homework, getting good grades, taking out trash, brushing teeth, cleaning up toys from the toy box. Okay, let me just grab a sink really quick. Boom, okay. Brush teeth, brush teeth. Oh, he's crying in the shower. So dramatic. It's almost there. Almost, almost. Bam! Harry's responsibility is in the range to earn the responsible trait. That's what's up. Okay, hopefully that doesn't fall out of the responsible trait by the time tomorrow rolls around. You also need to work- oh my gosh, your skills! Oh no! Come on, come play, come play, come play, come play. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Okay, 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 he's getting it. Bam, okay, good, good, good. Stop, stop. Wait, what? Level two? Oh. Really? No, oh, I forgot we were doing logic for him. Dang it. Come on, just get that skill up before you go. I know you're gonna be super late, but... Okay, there, he did it. Okay, go to school. Go, 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 go. Oh, yeah, yeah, this is stressful. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> okay, we have a toddler now. Independent, yes, queen. Thank God, okay. Okay, so we need a toddler bed. A toddler bed, a toddler bed, here we go, a toddler bed. When did we get this? Where did we get this? Oh, these are from when we decided everyone's careers. Dang, it's not fair if we sell them then. Who made pancakes? That's so cute. All right, let's check out this little bugger in Create a Sim. Okay, Clive Potter, who's your daddy? Oh, Benjamin. Okay, that's right, that's right, that's right. Yeah, Benjamin has blue eyes. Oh my gosh, it looks like he passed away. <gasps> when did that happen? Oh my God, jeez. I need to stop having babies with elders. Yeah, you've got your daddy's long chin. Oh boy, okay. You can have white hair like he had. Hey guys, here is Clive. What a cutie. Actually, I think Benjamin Long's hair was gray. <laughs> Whatever, he could have been blonde before he went gray. It's fine. I think he was blonde, actually, before he turned into an elder. I could have sworn he was, from what I can remember. Aw, she's sad from losing Benjamin. What trimester are you in? Third trimester in 44 minutes. Hey, another guy. You teen. Yeah, you are. Ugh! Wait, who's this? Ernesto Garcia. We definitely don't know you. Wait, don't go. Don't go. Don't go. Oh, he's gone. Dang it. All right, who else is walking by? Another elder? 
Hugo Villarreal. I can't risk you dying on me. Oh no, she aged up too. Oh no, everyone's aging up. Why is that so sad to me? We don't even know her, but she walks, jogs by our house every day and it's just sad. Who's this? You look like a teen. No, you're an adult. Aw, yeah. So she can do a cheerful introduction when she's sad, but she can't do a flirty introduction when she's sad. Just get to know him a little bit before we hit him with the romance. Great, she's so sad that she can't do anything flirty. For two days? What are we supposed to do? I'm gonna get her to call a sad sadness hotline. <sighs> two days of sadness? That is just so difficult. Oh yeah, you need to be working on your stuff, love. Uh, come stack. Actually, no, no, no. No stacking. Come babble. Babble, babble, babble. Babble, babble, babble. Who's this? He's the mail carrier. Ooh, should we flirt with the mail carrier? I mean, why not? <laughs> why not? Why not? Come on, do it. Hi. Would you like to father our children? It's going good, y'all. Okay, he's single. They're gonna go, they're gonna, why does it never work? What the heck? Ask to hang out. Quickly. No, 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 no! Why did Theodore's responsibility fall out of range? No, work on that. Did you get an A, by the way? Oh, you didn't. You didn't. Oh my god, that is so frustrating. Where's the male guy at? We asked him to hang out. Is this him? No, that's a scout. <laughs> Yikes. Where did he go? Lily better have freaking girls. Or I'm gonna be so upset. Getting that communication skill up. Level two. Pretty good. Keep it going. So you guys said that it is a... Is it really sun? No, it's cloudy. Okay. It was the retail display case. Okay. So if we cook stuff and put it in there, toddlers can grab it. Grab all the servings of this. Okay, where is it in your inventory? Yeah, okay, and then we pop it in here. And the toddler will be able to grab it. Oh my god, yes. And it's refrigerated so it won't go bad. Okay, that's that's great. That's amazing. Super stoked about that. Okay, so you did your homework. I'm going to need you to do your extra credit as well. Wait a minute. Where did you get a glimmer stone from? What the heck? Is it because you made mac and cheese in the cauldron? <laughs> well, that's just weird. Ooh, ooh, Lily has gone into labor. Did you finish this painting though? You did, $700. That's what's up, that's what's up, that's what's up, that's what's up. All right, let's have this baby. Let's have this baby at the hospital. At the hospital. Have baby at hospital, send alone. How old are you? Still six days. That's good, that's good, that's good. We're still doing great. <sighs> Send to daycare because it's illegal to have. It's a girl! Thank God! Thank God. Okay, we finally have a girl vampire. How exciting is that? So, her name is gonna be... Let's see. Her name's gonna be Quinn. I think that's a good vampire name. Quinn. Quinn Palta. Oh, yay! Okay, Quinn and... Let's do Liam. A lot of you guys ask for that name. Oh, twins. Lily and Caleb had twins. So we have... Oh my gosh, vampire twins. That's amazing. That is so good. Wait, so only one of them is a vampire? Because only one of them is in a vampire bassinet. That troubles me a little bit. Okay, she needs to get pregnant again. So, let's see. Um, Where's that one mailman guy? Darsh? 
Okay. Invite to hang out at current lot. Darsh will be right over. Oh, Darsh. Try for baby. Okay, it's starting to get chaotic again. Oops, no, don't practice your storytelling. I need you to take a pregnancy test. Ooh, she's pregnant again! Okay, okay, and the babies need something. I don't know what. But, and we can age them up now, right? They're both A students? Yes! And they're both responsible? Come on, mouse. Responsible. Responsible! All right, all right. Cook cake. All right, bring that cake here. All righty, it's y'all's birthday. Come and age up. Come make a wish. I'm so stoked. Sorry, I keep speeding up time. I'm sorry. Okay, so Harry's gonna be an overachiever, naturally thin, and introvert these sims don't really need to socialize okay that's cool i like it i like it i like it all right add birthday candles all right now you come make a wish what's up leah happy birthday theo we love you All right, so Theo's going to be a happy toddler, a geek, and gloomy. Okay, I love the gloomy trait, not going to lie. All right, add candles again. Just pop that in the fridge. Let's get him to decide his life. 17,259. I need notes. 17,259. Okay, and what did he get? He got bank savings amazing. He got, stop, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. He got bonus trait, clueless, career choice, lifeguard, and skill learning average. All right, Harry, let's do you next. <gasps> ah! Okay, he got bank savings amazing, dang it, I didn't see how much he got. Shoot. Shoot. I'll have to fix that later after I rewatch the video. Bonus trait, big appetite. He is average skill learner. What was your career? Business. Your sim chose business. Very interesting. Okay. So, don't worry about the money right now. I will fix it later. Okay, so we can move these two out now. All right, let's go to Manage Worlds and move out the two boys. All right, you go there, you go there, and there we go. Okay, they are out. I am so relieved that we had a girl. So, if we don't have any more girls, the next matriarch is gonna be a vampire. So that should be interesting. How are your skills going, little beanie? You need movement, potty, and thinking. Okay, we can do that. Go potty. Go potty over and over and over and over and over and over and over. Level two. Very good. All right, and then we're gonna turn on the music and have Clive bop around for his movement skill you're almost there bean keep going you did it so proud of you okay so next one is movement so come and bob to music we got mail uh oh the kid is depressed holy crap he's depressed because his dad died you poor dear what do we get in the mail Toys, vegetables, a time capsule, and it's almost the baby's birthdays. So I have just been making Lily paint. I'm putting all of her paintings in her inventory so we can sell them after we fix our money. Um, stop. I'm just 
taking care of the babies, waiting for Clive to wake up again. And yeah, it's kind of a little boring section, but um, yeah, it is what it is. Clive, are you going to grab that mac and cheese that's in there? Good boy. Ooh, and it's the younger baby's birthdays. <laughs> How exciting. More toddlers. Okay, let's, um, let's age them up. All right, Liam's going to be independent. Yes! Yes! All right, what about the other bean? Wild, of course. We've got to have one good one and one bad one, am I right? I mean, wild toddlers aren't necessarily bad. They're just harder to look after. My eyes hurt. All right, so your guys' is daddy? Caleb, I remembered on my own. Yeah, they have angry eyebrows because they're Caleb's kids. There you go. So here's Quinn. And then Liam. Oh, okay. So Liam is a vampire and Quinn is not. <gasps> no! I wanted a female vampire. That's kind of unfortunate. Okay. Wow. Your brows though. <gasps> Pointy ears. What in God's name? Okay. This is a very interesting looking child. None of the eyebrows look good. What are we gonna do with you? Seriously, what the heck are we gonna do? Okay, these are the only ones that look semi-normal. Oh god. Why do all my vampire kids look weird? <laughs> Oh my gosh, those ears. Holy cannoli. <sighs> okay. Sure. There you go, little Liam. Okay, so as of right now, Quinn is going to be the one that takes over. So, unless we have more girls in the next... In the next pregnancy. All right, start working on your skills, love. How are your skills doing? You need movement and thinking. Check it out, this is a masterpiece. Nice one. Okay, come do flashcards with him. How did you already reach communication level three? That is insane. We need more toddler beds. More toddler beds. More! Oh, there's homework right here. More toddler beds. Boom, boom, boom. Time for bed. You as well. Thank you, Leah. You are such an angel. Okay, she is in question mark, question mark, question mark. So that means she'll be having, having birth soon. <laughs> Um, so I'm very excited to see what she has. Like, so freaking stoked. Hopefully it's more girls. Alright, gang. It's time to get up. Time to eat. I'm gonna get Lily to potty train Quinn. Because she's not the independent one. Uh-oh, we, we got bills. 1,508. Not bad. Not too bad. Okay, it looks like Clive is almost there. I've had him on his tablet for like ever and his thinking is almost there. There we go. All right, go potty boy. Ooh, and Lily's in labor. <gasps> oh! All right, Clive is good. We can age him up now. But first, I'm gonna get Lily to go to the hospital and have her baby. Hopefully, babies, hopefully, plural. Okay, have baby at hospital, send alone. All y'alls can go to daycare. Okay, let's see what she gets. Let's see what she gets. I'm so excited. It's a girl. <laughs> okay, um, I'm gonna go with Piper. Piper Potter. So cute. 
<laughs> Yay! Um, Parker. Piper and Parker. Piper and Parker Potter. <laughs> All right. Twins, 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 twins. Wait. Huh? I guess he is darker. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay, let's get this cake out and age up Clive, and then that will be the end of the episode. So, more choices. Help blow out candles. Clive. Yeah, because he got to level 3 on all his skills, so he's good to go. Happy birthday, Clive! <laughs> mischievous. These sims build the mischief faster because of how mischievous they are. Okay, and we need an aspiration. Social butterfly is what we got. Again. Okay, Clive. Let's see, let's give you back your white hair because I really liked it. You look just like your dad. That's so funny. There you go, Clive. You need lashes on this outfit and then you're all good. All right, everybody, here's Clive. This was Benjamin Long's kid. Okay, actually, to end this episode, we are going to get Lily pregnant again. So how many days until she ages up? She's still at six. Dang, so we can pop out some more. Um, let's see, Bryce maybe? Let's invite him over and see how it goes. He has a spouse, so that's gonna be tricky, but let's give it a try. No! She's so tired! Wait, I thought having the baby at the hospital, like, fixed her needs. What the heck are they doing? <gasps> what the heck? I am so confused about why this is happening, but they just autonomously went to try for baby. I mean, I'm not mad about it, but like... Their relationship is super low from what I can remember. Where is it? Where even is he? He isn't even in the romance one. Okay, what the heck. Will you please feed the baby? Come on. Oh my gosh. What a freaking whirlwind. Oh, she has a potion of plentiful needs. She can just drink this. There, all better. Did you take a pregnancy test? You didn't. Okay, go ahead and do that. Are you pregnant again? Oh, it never fails, ever. It's crazy. It's just so crazy. Let's get his communication skill up so that he'll be good in school. Okay, there we go. Level three. He's all good. He just needs to do his homework. And then the two toddlers, slowly but surely getting there. Slowly but surely. Okay, guys, I'm going to leave this part right here. It was an extremely successful episode. I'm very, very pleased. I was honestly a little bit worried that we weren't going to have a girl, but we have plenty of girls now. So yeah, leave me a comment. Let me know if you're still enjoying this series, and I will see you guys in my next video. I love you.